Hi there, so in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to work with WBCRM. I have installed this plugin by clicking on plugins, then clicking on add new. And on this page, I simply searched for keyword WBCRM. You can also go with just CRM. You will find the plugin WBCRM on the page. So just select WPCRM from here. We can just specifically go with this to avoid searching. Okay, so this is the plugin I'm using WPCRM. Let me close this and here it's how it looks it creates a tab here called CRM and we get to do the settings like we have options for all people new person my profile and settings click on settings to check what this is all about okay. so you, here you have tabs leading to tell you there is main UI data roles notifications and premium features and there is also help file so here you get to see the updates if you have premium version if you have notifications sending mail to your other users and what roles are for each so I'm administrator so I get to use everything here then you have data what sort of data you are collecting like display name user email Company, phone number, user type, I am and description. Then you have UI, which you have it here. And let's go to check how it looks. So this is your CRM where you're going to have your leads. Okay, so first thing you're going to do is you're going to create a new person, clicking on add new or clicking on this new person link then you're going to type name like Alan then name is Alan at um, then you have its company name then it is customer vendor or employee okay and then you're gonna save this one Okay, click on the save button. So now you find a new profile is created, which you can check from all people link. So you have two users right now then you can go to my profile to check my settings okay so here I have actions like setting password also activity related history my primary information and things I can do here like setting color scheme and other actions that same actions can be accessed from tools sorry settings and general also from tools available tools that also can be done so basically what we can do right now is add new people from all people tab Okay. and get to edit these users as well okay you can also export this information to a csv file we can visualize this user data and we can scroll through records if we have here with the buttons first previous next and last so let's click on visualize user data and you find 
many employees are there and how many are unaccounted so 50 per 50 percent are there so more you user add and set the type then you will get to visualize this data even deeper so this is very simple CRM there is nothing or more to it but you get to use this CRM right here on your WordPress dashboard so this is very handy if you want to keep tab of all your leads and all your customers or vendors or employees from your WordPress dashboard so if you want simple CRM like this then WP CRM is one good choice so I hope you found this tutorial helpful I'll see you in the next video thank you